There is an effort to revive a key species here in the state, the alewife. Its numbers were depleted due to overfishing and dam construction, but over the last few years we're seeing more alewives, more than we've seen since the 1980s, and that is big news for lobstermen. News Center Maine's Jack Mulmott explains. Oh, this method is probably 50 years old. Dana Johnson has been working this alewife harvesting trap for more than 30 years. We look forward to it every year, you know. This is the work commercial fishermen do before they start their day, with each time the harvesters grab the net, dip it into the water and pulling up hundreds of pounds of alewives before dumping it into the trough. Our catch has increased every year for the last 10 years. It's promising. As the alewives get put into bins and sent off with lobstermen, who will that, use this bait fish to fill annoying. their traps. But the bountiful harvest of the alewife was not always this easy. Go back a few decades and you'll see the resource mostly abandoned. It was slow. It was, you know, half as many fish as it was. Historical data from the Department of Marine Resources shows the massive dip taken in the 80s and 90s. Harvesters here say it was a mix between overfishing and dams. And those dams prevented the alewives from migrating from the sea to lakes. A huge factor in the alewife's population rebound has been the removal of dams, either man-made or done by beaver populations, like here in the St. George's River. Oh, it's an awesome story. Jerry Cushman, a Port Clyde lobsterman, bait dealer, and also helping the town of Warren oversee the harvest of alewives. Great story. Great success story. He says the regulations put in place by the Department of Marine Resources, combined with the removal of dams, reopened the door for a familiar bait fish that lobstermen can use now. Great bait, it's fresh. And especially during tough times. Low lobster price, high fuel price, high bait price. But I think uh, the fuel's coming down. Bait's definitely going to come down. A benefit to Maine lobstermen. They bring life. Oh, yeah. Look at the birds. Look at all, you know, look at, look at all the life around here. And also Maine's ecosystem. In Warren, Jack Mulmud, New Center, Maine. Well, the Department of Marine Resources says while the rebound for alewives in Maine is outstanding, we're still only about 5% of what that population used to be. They do expect the population to double in the next 10 to 15 years.